guys, Shell Zelda here, and I'm back with a new crochet. This is not quite crochet, no, is it? It's box braids. <laughs> yes, I wanted to do something different. I didn't feel like doing a crochet, even though on my other videos say, oh, I don't feel like wearing the kinky, cr the crochet kinky twist. So, so all right, I'll, I'll crochet some hair in, some hair and you know and i'll be happy and i was happy with the chemo Bray ripple deep and um i thought it was very pretty but um honestly i wanted more freedom to do more stuff to my hair so i thought why not hey do some box braids or even micros i try to do micros i would say these were these are about medium medium micro braids probably not these are medium <laughs> I tried to do them small, but you know, I was like, listen, I have to take these out. So I didn't do them that small. But this is also Kima Braid hair. This is Kima Braid Brazilian Twist. You would, it's just, I love the hair. I love, and guess what? Oh, and by the way, just to let you guys know, my hair is about like almost three weeks old. Yeah, I had this in for like almost three weeks. Sorry for the delay of the video. I'm like kind of busy. I'm between working and doing other people's hair and also making a wig for my mom. I haven't had a chance to record when I finish my hair, but this is about three, almost three weeks old and I, I still love it. I tried, I'm not the best at, I can box braid, but I'm not the best at my parting. I'm not good at, I'll do way too many parts and it'll take me way too long. But yes, this is, this is my box braid. If it looks like, if it looks like it has residue on it or build up product build up it's because i put um i put the jam on to help me grip the hair and like an idiot i put it on <laughs> i got some of it on my scalp and when jam dries it definitely leaves like some residue or whatever so next time i know i'm just only gonna put it on the hair not my own hair but this is yeah i try to box braid i'm not the best at it you know that's my parts or whatnot. But I actually really love this hair. It took me a couple of days. I, I cannot do braids or hair or anything in, in one day. Like I said, my schedule when I get home from work, I cook, I clean, I eat, and take a shower. Then that whatever time after that, that's what I have to do in my hair. Yes, it took me a few days, uh, a little at a time to do this. Now I use four, four packs of this cut in half four full packs and half. I love it and guess what I had this for what what did I say about two weeks going on three and remember and I, I said in the Kima Brave Ripple Deep if you watched that video I said in the Kima Brave Ripple Deep video that after like two weeks the back starts getting knotted guess what no knots no tangles no knots no nothing and the reason is is because Usually when you crochet it onto your scalp, here's the hair and here's the hair for the next row. And it guess what? After a while, the hair, when it rubs together, it starts to rub. And then eventually it intertwines like that and it locks. And it usually it's the bottom of your hair in the back of your head. And you don't pay attention to it. So by the time you figure it out, it already done matted itself together like this. And you're like, <laughs> but when it's braided, it can't intertwine because these are braids. So the braids just kind of go against each other. Therefore leaving the hair like sitting on top of each other like that. Basically this hair can last longer than two weeks if you box braid it. I was worried, it was like, should I box braid? You know what box braids I try to keep in for about two months. And am I gonna put this synthetic chemo braid hair which lasts about two weeks? Is it gonna mat? And I'm stuck with these matted box braids. No, it's no tangle. No, it's tangle. And um, in the three weeks, I washed it about twice. I kind of wash it like once a week because to me, my hair starts smelling. You don't have to wash it as much, but my hair starts smelling. The first week, I just washed the hair itself. I like washing the hair because when I wash the hair, I notice the texture changes. It, it, to me, it gets a little curly. It just gets a little bit curlier. That's why I'm wondering. If it has a little bit of human hair in it, I'm not sure. But to me, it gets a little bit more tightly curled. And I like to wash it so I can put 
my cream on it and stuff. I like to do that when the hair is clean. So, and then the second time I washed it, I washed my scalp because I was getting so much buildup from the tag on jam. It, my whole scalp was white at one point. So I was like, let me not. I, I really love it. And I plan on doing, plan on doing styles with this and everything. And I will have a follow up video a little bit later to show the styles I achieved within I'm gonna try to keep it in for two months or even a whole solid month because I like to change my hair, but I'm gonna try to keep it in for at least two months. And I'll show you a video later on, um, a few weeks from now, all the hairstyles I was doing with this because I usually start doing a lot of styles. And that's the main reason why I wanted some box braids so I could do some styles with it like that. <laughs> but I will show you, <laughs> I will show you guys the torture I was going through. I will show you the process of me braiding my hair with a little music. I always put gaming music, don't mind me. I'm weird guys, you know that. <laughs> like I said, I'll be back with a maintenance video slash styles video. I already started recording for that. And my next video is gonna be African hair braiding horror story. Yeah, yeah, I had to, I had to. Since I was like, oh, I'm gonna be braiding my hair, it made me think of the last time I went to get my hair box braided. <sighs> and that's a story in itself. It's not quite a full horror story. It's kind of like an African hair braiding dilemma slash horror story. So I'm working on that. I'm editing that right now. And that I'm gonna be putting that out soon. Soon, soon, soon. So but I only had like one bad experience. So I just kind of have like one video of that. But I will be back with that video. And I, like I said, I'll be back with my follow-up video on how the styles and how I maintain this hair. Um, I would try to show you the back. I hope you could see it because I can't. I'm like sitting on my bed. I can't quite do a U-turn. <laughs> right now but this is a yeah Kima Bray Brazilian twist I brought four packs I used four packs cut in half and I trimmed the ends a little bit of course and uh, you'll see in the next clip I do show the pack of hair and everything but see you guys in the next video thanks for watching